Ms. Slayman, you know, the president can appoint aggressive enforcers. Uh, he can issue executive orders, which was great. But if we don't have the resources uh, to take on the world's biggest companies, is it going to all work? Right. I think you're absolutely right, uh, Madam Chairwoman. We need more funding for our antitrust enforcement agencies. Obviously, that alone is, is not going to be sufficient. So I'm glad that you're working on a lot of other uh, important pieces of the puzzle as well. But but that's a um, an important one that we ought to be able to get done. Okay, very good. Um, and then um, we have not seen a lot of antitrust enforcement against mergers or anti-competitive conduct based on the issue raised by um, what this hearing has, uh, for the most part, focused on, which is data. It's clear that big data does raise complex competition issues, uh, but I'm doubtful that when you see some of these court cases recently, that in my mind uh, have gone in the wrong direction to begin with, but then we have this complex area of uh, data and what that means for dominant carriers with no new laws or adjustment of laws. Um, and that's why the Competition and Antitrust Law Enforcement Reform Act that I introduced with Senators Leahy, Blumenthal, Booker, and many others uh, would update our laws. Um, could you talk about how this would help to address competition issues raised by big data? Yes, thank you so much, Madam Chairwoman. I think that's absolutely right um, that recently, uh, and, and not so recently, it's, it's been going on for decades now that our antitrust laws have been narrowed and narrowed by these court decisions. Um, and so now that we are facing the difficult challenges of big data, it's very difficult uh, to bring a case, um, for example, where innovation harms are an important part of, uh, you know, what, what the agencies are trying to argue. Um, so I think it will be incredibly helpful to have um, your legislation in place that updates the legal standard, both for mergers and for exclusionary conduct. Um, exclusionary conduct in particular is how a lot of these big data concerns are happening. And it has um, uh, really been difficult to bring exclusionary conduct cases, uh, which is a broader problem beyond big data, uh, but is particularly relevant here. Mm -hmm. 